My name's Tiffany Bennett. I'm a livestock consultant with Pool Solutions SA, the extension arm for PERSA. We're here today at the Strawn Research Farm with John Cooper, the farm manager at Strawn Farm here, and Michael Wilkes from Thomas Elder Consulting. We'll be looking at remote way options for cattle, and looking at the OptiWay system and the opportunities and benefits that that provides. Elders and the Thomas Elder Institute have partnered with PERSA to undertake a strategic partnership to turn the Struan and Kybe Bolite research farms into best practice demonstration farms. And uh, a big part of that is the strategic use of ag tech to improve the productivity and efficiency of our farming businesses. Part of that is technology such as this, which is the OptiWay remote cattle weighing system, which enables us to weigh cattle in the paddock real time without having to yard them and dramatically reducing our labour component. Yeah, so we uh, had the OptiWay delivered here in uh, late January, so we've had it for uh, four months now. As you can see, it's uh, being well used. It's uh, rubbed and uh, full of mud. We've used it firstly to monitor our heifer live weights, looking to get our heifers up to a mating weight in June, and also for our steer weights going into our cell grazing program we'd like we like to keep our steers going forward at this time of the year before we get into winter so it's been a very effective tool in uh, in both those things it's a really good way daily to just get a percentage of the mob coming over the machine and you can just look each day or each week and say yes my feeding program's working they're gaining weight or no it's not working they're losing weight whatever you want to do but it uh, is just a really good way of monitoring the performance of your cattle. It's like any other weighing system, it doesn't take very long to get a, a weight. You'll see that the cattle, they, they do spend their time in there licking the molasses, so uh, that's not an issue, but uh, it does weigh them quite quickly. We finish a lot of Frisian bulls into the export market. The first job we had with the OptiWay was in our cell grazing systems, monitoring the weight of our bulls looking to see which, which mobs were getting uh, up to sale weight and tracking that. So uh, it did a good job of that. And as you can see, bulls are always pretty rough on equipment and uh, the OptiWay stood up to that really well. So there's multiple ways that we can weigh livestock remotely in the paddock. Typically that's been uh, a walkover weighing system where animals walk over a, a full load platform and their entire weight is measured, typically as they move to a water source. Um, those systems work well, um, but do require more infrastructure in terms of fencing. Um, OptiWay here measures the front, front feed of the animal, um, and then based on the weight of that and the, the class and age of the animal, um, the algorithms are then used to, to predict the whole live weight of the animal, and we're getting very good correlations between, between the OptiWay weight and, and actual live weights measured in the yards. The main benefit of remote weighing livestock is A, labour saving, um, in that you're not yarding animals frequently, um, keeping them off feed, putting them through stressful uh, handling procedures. Um, the other thing is to be able to actually monitor their performance real time and make sure A, that they're tracking to their weight gain goals um, and that your feeding regimes are appropriate and B, also monitoring their trajectory to a market endpoint, particularly for animals destined for a slaughter endpoint. We can make sure that they're, they're tracking right, performing how we, how we like, um, and, and if they're not, we can make a management intervention to ensure that they're, they're going to uh, pick up their performance. As you can see, it's fairly easy to move. It's very lightweight, portable, towable. Even a quad bike can tow it around, um, and basically how how it works when it's out in the paddock here is we have a weigh scale underneath with load bars, a small trough inside which we place an attractant, typically a mineral lick or salt or molasses, a EID panel reader that reads the animal's ear tag, that then feeds into a scale head behind the panel. Basically the beast walks on, puts its front feet on the weigh scale, licks at the attractant, the tag is read the weight of the animal, the front half of the animal is taken and collects the data, sends it wirelessly through 4G signal through to uh, a server where the data is collated and then um, available for the producer through an interface um, online where they can see cattle weights and, uh, and monitor the performance of their, their herd. 
So here we have the uh, online interface that the data from the OptiWay unit feeds back to. Here's one of the displays that we can look at the average weight by day, whereby the blue bars are the number of animals that have visited the OptiWay on any given day, and the green line is our average weight for those animals that have visited the machine. So what we're looking at is what data I receive from the OptiWay cattle weighing machine down in the paddock. So as you'll see, every morning I get a uh, summary sent to my office computer, which uh, shows us uh, the number of animals that have been in the machine, the number of records recorded, uh, the average weight and the weight range of those animals recorded that day. This is the email message I receive every morning. If you're an early riser, it comes in at about one o'clock in the morning. But uh, it just gives you a summary of what's happened the previous day. So you can see yesterday being the 19th, we're in the Angus steer mob. Seven animals had been in the uh, OptiWay crate that day, and we've got 22 records from those seven animals. Uh, as a percentage of the mob, it's only 6%. Their average weight, 402 weight range 353 to 464. So a very thumbnail sketch, at least you know the machine's working, what's happening. And then uh, you can go through and uh, look at some of the summaries it produces for you. This particular one uh, lists the animal identification down the left hand side and by each week the, uh, the average weight of that animal. So you can follow through, this was a particularly good animal, it's been in there every week and you can follow through and just see what is its live weight doing, is it, uh, is it holding, is it gaining or is it losing. So as a percentage of the mob you can then tailor things such as I had mentioned before, heifer mating weights. Are we, uh, are we on track to get the heifers to a mating weight on the 1st of June? And this sort of data gives you a really good um, heads up on what's happening out in the paddock. You can of course download that into an Excel spreadsheet uh, for your, your data recording if you want to keep, keep it that way. I always just leave it in this uh, OptiWay format. I find that's fine for me and uh, is readily available. As I said, we've had it since January. All the records are easily stored and brought up in this particular fashion, but you can download it uh, and uh, then play with it as you would like. So one of the main applications of this is to be able to have a snapshot uh, of your herd weight and their growth rate performance over time. Um, without having to yard them. Um, basically 20 to 30 percent snapshot, I guess, of, of weights of the animals will, will enable you to see how the, how the herd is tracking overall. Yeah, with the OptiWay, there's no calibration or anything you need to do. It, uh, it's got a full electronic set of weigh cells on there ready to go, so there's no issues about uh, having to calibrate your scales. That's preset and uh, has been right on. We've compared the weights we're getting on the OptiWay with uh, weighing the actual cattle in the yards itself and uh, there's no issue there, it's very close. The OptiWay is a standalone unit. It uh, doesn't need anything else, it's completely uh, self-contained. Powered by this solar panel and you've got a uh, long life battery stored down the bottom here out of the way and uh, protected in a, in a box from the animals. So the only consideration you have to have is uh, to have the uh, solar panel facing north just to maximise its output. We've used the OptiWay in our farm enterprises here at Struan, so we haven't had to worry too much about the biosecurity from mob to mob, but as you can see, it's, uh, it's, it's a waterproof machine, very easy to wash down and, and uh, hose off with disinfectant if you're going between farms or you have a biosecurity issue you want to address. So the OptiWay is uh, about $15,000 to buy, so it's a reasonable investment uh, to uh, come on farm with. One of the things we, we are keen is to just do an evaluation of are we getting value for money with it. Um, so over the, the next couple of months we'll be able to do a, a cost benefit to our operation about has that expense been worth it. And uh, as it's going along at the moment, I'm finding it a very useful tool. Um, so depending on how many cattle you've got and uh, what sort of inputs you're putting into, the, uh, into your herd, yeah, you'll be able to do that cost benefit and we'll be able to provide uh, our figures, figures as well to help you make those decisions. 
As part of the best practice demonstration farm that Elders and Persa have got into partnership on here at Struan, we'll be implementing a range of ag tech and management practices around the farm and, and, and the performance of those and, and the effect that they have on the farm business will be, will be benchmarked and uh, a cost benefit will be, will be determined for them and, and we'll be able to demonstrate that to producers um, within the region and throughout the country um, what, what the benefits of, of using innovation and technology in livestock production system is, how it can improve the profitability of their businesses and, and make life easier and that's a really key focus of the best practice demonstration farm. As you can see, there are plenty of opportunities that the OptiWay will provide beef producers to help remotely manage their cattle better. Thank you to Michael Wilkes and John Cooper for providing the information today.